we're doing this again. The guys are looking for some cheap, instant mad and ultimate team coins. Check out muttmarket.com. Use code RBT. Yes, RBT. For 15% off your purchase. This very well might be the dumbest video I've ever uploaded. And um, <laughs> that's saying a lot. But today, it is time to set another world record. Over the past few weeks, we've been going for the Mutt Draft world record. At first, we set it with an 87 overall draft, and once somebody broke that, I almost transcended myself into a different metaphysical planet to get to, <laughs> Once again, to reach that 88 overall Mutt Draft world record. And today, we're gonna be setting another world record, but of a different kind. This time, we are going to attempt to get the lowest possible mutt draft in Madden 19 and it's strictly just gonna be from the draft not once the draft is over and swapping players around no the premise is to get the lowest possible draft from the 20 rounds and to see how low we can actually make that overall number get to and genuinely I have no idea what the possibilities are when it comes to getting the lowest overall mutt draft I have no idea if you get a sub 80 or not not sure how many drafts I'm actually gonna try but I'm gonna draft until I'm happy with the lowest overall world record mutt draft. And once again, I know this is freaking dumb. <laughs> I know this is stupid, but if you haven't noticed, that's the theme of my channel at this point. Ah, uh, it's too late. It's too freaking late. But you guys have been enjoying the drafts on the channel, hence why we're doing this stupid freaking thing today. If you guys still want to see more drafts on the channel, make sure to smash that thumbs up. But let's get to draft number one. Few things. The pool of players that you can draft right now is different from what you could draft like a month ago. So I know like a month ago, it was more than likely possible to get a lower overall draft than what it's going to be possible to get today. So technically, it's going to be the world record for the lowest overall mud draft current in Madden 19. Number two, I did a couple test drafts before this. And literally just today, I'm like 99% sure they added new cards into Mutt Draft. And it's stupid because it's not the freaking Team of the Year cards that everybody wants to play with the Mutt Draft. It's like some of the playoff cards. So you might see some new cards. I'm not sure if that will affect like if somebody can get over an 88 overall draft now. Because there are some new higher rated cards in draft but nothing too crazy like Team of the Year's. Don't know why the heck they added new cards in the Mutt Draft and not added the most recent cards in Team of the Year. But I don't freaking know. And last but not least, number three. The weather's awful. The weather's absolutely awful. And my desk is right next to a window and there's rain. So if you hear rain and thunder, I can't freaking stop Mother Nature. But with that said, too long of a freaking intro. Let's go with Todd. Todd's no longer a head coach. So how perfect is it for this mud draft? To try to get the lowest overall mud draft to have a coach that just got freaking fired. And just like the rest of my world record draft videos, I'm gonna show you the first full draft and then just the highlights from then on just to see how low we can actually get. We started at a 73. Sometimes we started at a 74, sometimes at a 72. So we got in the middle here. And I'm telling you guys, it's gonna be harder than what you freaking think. You gotta be methodical with it. You gotta be strategic. And I want everybody out there to try this as well and try to get the lowest overall possible mud draft. I want you guys all to tweet at me your lowest mud draft. See if you can beat me today. But you have to take the picture right after the 20th round so I know it's legit. So I know you didn't go back and change positions. We'll start off with the lowest overall. 89 Mario Addison and the goal from what I've seen thus far is to try and get as many duplicate positions as possible like see right here this Dwayne Brown trust me I did a thousand drafts at least a thousand drafts trying to get that world record 88 overall draft never saw these cards at all I just don't understand why they just now added these cards in and they didn't add team of the year but it is what it is this is a new card but we're gonna go with the lowest overall here so 88 center Marquise Pouncey round number four and we go ahead and get a cornerback and get the corners out of the way i think i will because we're gonna get a ton of corners this round we will go with the lowest overall wide receiver it's gonna be difficult i think because we're already at a 77 but once it gets later on in the draft it gets a little bit easier because it's so many duplicate positions you can pick from but we do get a pretty good corner there round number seven See, this is where we start going duplicate position. We already have a right in. I'll take right in every single round if we could get it. So don't we already have a tight in? We do. So that's another duplicate position as well. This is so freaking stupid. See, that's a new card too. Demarius Thomas, 93 overall. So with some of these cards being added in, it probably has been beat. I guarantee somebody within the next week or so will tweet me an 89 rated draft and that will kill me because that will make me want to make another video and I can't do it I just can't freaking do it that took that just ruined my weekend but anyways go with the lowest overall wide receiver there and Michael Thomas round 10 here I know I know 88 is the lowest overall but in terms of what we want to do 
I want to stick with the right ends because that basically is just a wasted round because we already have two other right ends. Round number 11. That's a good running back round. That sucks. We normally, in all the videos, when I try to get good drafts, we get awful running back rounds. And when I try to do awful, we get good running back rounds. It's like EA just listens to me. But anyways, another offensive lineman we're going to take here is Jack Conklin. We already had an 80 overall, so we've already freaking failed. But this is just a test. Actually, no, we're at a 79. The middle linebacker bumps me up to an 80. We're still at a 79, but it's going to be over an 80 for this first draft. That's just a fact. And once again, see, it's another new card. 95, Zach Martin. Where were these cards when I was trying to get an 88? I guarantee 89 is, like, like possible now. And that's, gonna, that's just going to piss me off. Aaron Donald is going to be the selection. Let's get our fourth right in here. Round 15. Do we go another wide? No, we're going to go another tight end because that's just what we're going to do. Delaney Walker, round 16. Like, this is a new card too. Tyreek Hill, Calvin Ridley, all these cards are new, dude. It's like they watched my videos and like, oh, we got to update the mud draft so we can have to do another world record draft. Dude, now I'm just going to be pissed. Anyways, we're going to have to go Tyreek Hill here. Round 17. I actually probably should have went Gronk. It is what it is. So here, cornerback is going to be the move since we already have three. We're already at an... Dude, what if I actually got the 88 when I was trying to get the lowest? That would be fun. Once again, it's a great quarterback round opposed to what we were trying to do before when we were trying to get the higher draft. Phillip Rivers is going to be the selection. Round 19. That might be the first time I've seen a legend not in the legend round. Rondé Barber. But anyways, we'll go with AJ Bouye. In round 20, we are going to go after another tight end and Jeremy Shockey. And with all, I know he picked a lot of duplicate positions, and when you click this button, it generates your best auto lineup, so it moves some of those players to other positions, so it's probably going to boost up to like an 84. Yes, so an 84 overall draft, and when I told you guys, I want you to tweet at me your drafts, this is the picture you're going to have to take, because after this, everybody can just move their starters out of the lineup, so that would be cheating, and this right here is the screen I want you to take pictures of and send to me. So we're starting off at an 84, which is hilarious, because <laughs> one of my drafts, I was actually trying, I got an 84, we actually got an 87 freaking offense not even trying if you guys want me to actually go for an 89 overall draft this has got to get some type of insane amount of likes because you guys think i'm kidding i promised you i draft for over 20 hours this weekend i promise and it, was, it just wasn't freaking worth it so maybe they juiced the running back and quarterback round Maybe, maybe they, I, I legitimately think they probably did see my videos and was like, hey, we do need to boost up the running back and quarterback round, so you're welcome, guys. At the expense of my mental health, you guys got a better butt trap. They actually did do that because of my video. They're going to be a little pissed off because they could have done it sooner. Anyways, we'll go with Rob here, the lowest overall. I think we are going to end up, unfortunately, hitting an 80, although Ezekiel Ons, oh, that's a big one. Now we do hit the 80. It's for sure going to be a freaking 80. It's probably, well, up to a freaking 81. Oh, see, I think what they probably did was make the lowest overall quarterback 90 instead of 88. And the lowest overall running back, I haven't seen less than a 90 yet. So maybe it's a 90 and above. So maybe both quarterback and running back, the minimum threshold is 90 overall. Which means you probably can't get an 89 overall mud draft. Man, oh, I'm going to have to do it, aren't I? I'm going to have to go for that 89 rated mud draft. So here we are, round 20. We'll go with another tight end here in Dallas Clark. We're at 81. Can at least be a boost up to an 84. Dog, I'm trying to get bad drafts on purpose. As long as I can get an 83 here, I'll be okay. As long as we're making improvement towards the goal. Because out of all the recording sessions I've done for mutt drafts this year, especially lately, the lowest I've got is 84. So 83 would be a record for me at least. Jesus. This is freaking, <laughs> dude, this is freaking harder than getting the 88. See, bro, that's the first time I've seen a 95 overall quarterback in a round. So there's going to be some crazy drafts out there now. If anything, this video shows you that you can get probably an 89 overall draft now. So you guys do know Mud Draft is updated at the bare minimum. And it just happened today. Now, that just makes my video look stupider because it's actually probably going to be like an 83. It's going to be like the lowest you can possibly get because these rounds are sick to be fair. So maybe I do actually have to try for that 89 soon. But guys, you have to smash some type of crazy amount of likes because I don't know if I can put myself through it again. Let's see. Hopefully there's an 83. That's what I'm shooting for right now. An 83 is going to be the goal. So round 20. These rounds continue to be sick. Just be 83. 84 again, dog. I took like 103 linemen and over 15 free safeties. And yet, we're basically getting what I got when I actually tried. Guys, I really don't think it's possible. 
I do not think it's possible to get under an 84 overall draft. And that makes me look so dumb, but guys, this video idea was so much better than what the updated Mutt Draft. Obviously, I'm happy that they updated Mutt Draft, but this video just won't have the same effect as it should have if I recorded it yesterday. But everything happens for a reason. We're going to keep on trying for that 83. And if we can't get that 83, and you can, you're a wizard. Two rounds to go, guys, and this one has potential. I have a feeling this is going to be the first 83 overall mud trap. Okay, so we have a ton of wide receivers. That keeps me at an 80. So just a free safety. I'm going to go with the wide receiver because we have like five wide receivers at this point. 82! Boom! We did it! <laughs> I am actually... <laughs> I'm actually happier about getting this than I am getting the 88 overall draft. Jesus, dog, I would have been happy with an 83, and we slid right into an 82. Boom! So that, currently, with this Mutt draft pool, with the players that are now available two days ago, or yesterday, it would have been different. But now, right now, this is going to be the current world record lowest Mutt draft out there. If you guys can beat this, you're a freaking hooligan. You're on some type of different, like, metaphysical plane. Because that's the only explanation. Because this is freaking hard. The dude, like, it took over an hour just to get an 82 overall draft trying to get the worst draft possible. I'm going to try a few more. It's going to probably be an 83, maybe. 83. So, that's higher than the last one. But it's better than the 84s I was getting the first few times. So, I just realized something within the Mutt draft. And I'm not sure really what it means. But I do know before, when you got a 95 overall player or higher and around, your controller would vibrate. No longer does that. So does that mean there's like another threshold of like overall that's available that makes your controller vibrate? Because it hasn't happened yet. Now that is for sure a new one, Otto Graham. I've never seen him in draft before. And now it's 96 and didn't get my controller to vibrate on that one. So with that, we'll take the quarterback, another 83. Guys, I'm telling you. If you can get an 81, you have some type of DNA makeup directly from Hogwarts. Yeah, guys, I am convinced that I just need to count my blessings with that 82 overall because it's not getting any lower than that. Like I said, man, if you can get lower than an 82 and break my world record of the current possible lowest overall mutt draft, tweet at me. Let me know that I'm a failure because an hour and a half of trying to get the lowest possible draft only got me an 82 but guys, I think after doing that and seeing the cards available, I might have to put myself through it again. I might actually have to go for the next world record. Break the current world record of an 88, which I did tie, and try to hit that first 89 and maybe first ever 90 overall. I know somebody's probably going to break it tonight after watching this video because you guys love tweeting at me when you break my records. But that's going to take a lot of support to do that because, <laughs> oh God. Um, that was a miserable weekend, but I'll do it if you guys enjoy it. But that's gonna do it for me. 82 overall mud drafts, the lowest we can get. Subscribe if you are new. I'll catch you guys next time. Have a great rest of your day. God bless and peace.